I listened to my mother. She said, don't let anybody in. Hi, Donnies. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, I ask you to please subscribe because you're helping this disabled by watching my fables so I don't have to beg you. <laughs> so this story is about <sighs> she told me not to let them in. See, I was a latchkey kid and um, if some of those that don't know what a latchkey kid is, basically my mom was a single mom and I had a key to the house, but no one supervising me. <clears throat> so with that said, when I would come home from school, I would have to call my mom at her job and let her know that I'm in the house. There was no such thing as cell phones back then. Well, one day these people came to the house and they were knocking on the door and they knew I was in there but I was one of those obedient children and I listened to my mother. She said, don't let anybody in. And she meant anybody. Well, like I said, these people were persistent. They were like, let us in. What's wrong? Let us in. Let us in. And since they were so insistent, I called my mom at the job and I was like, can I let them in? And she was like, what did I tell you? Don't let anyone in. So no, they cannot come in. So I didn't let them in. They stayed in the car <laughs> and waited for my mom to get home. Now you guys, while I'm talking, you can put in the comment section, who do you think was at the door and why they were so persistent to come in knowing this little girl's in the house all by herself she stranger danger stranger danger she can't open the door for strangers <laughs> well like i said they waited in the car until my mom came home and when my mom came home she explained to them why i couldn't let anybody in she didn't care who they were they could not come in unless she was in the house. After a while, they understood my mother's um, reasoning and they later laughed about it. But at the time, they were hot. They were like, I can't believe this child won't let us in. Okay. So these people that were so insistent that this little girl in the house all by herself should open the door for them happened to be my mom's parents. Yes, my grandparents. I couldn't even let my grandparents in. My mom's reasoning was because since I was such a young girl, she didn't want me to have to like figure out which family member I can let in and which family I couldn't let in. Better, you know, what is it better safe than sorry? So she didn't want me to have to decipher who's safe to let in and who's not safe to let in, even if they are family members, because we all heard about uncles and aunties molesting people that they're close to. So my mom was like, you know what? We just gonna cut everything and you can't let anybody in unless I'm in the house or unless I say so. So that's my quick story about why she wouldn't let me let them in. And um, you guys share if you have a similar story down in the comment section below. Donnie's remember to toast to life because it always makes for a great story. Please check out my other content on the channel and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next week. Bye.